Sending them out. Testing. <laughs> Hello, can you hear us? No, what I don't think you can. Have you turned that up up there? It is turned on up there. Is it? Yes. Can you what's, not? what's the audio like there, please? Can you can it there. That there, right there. So How'd that there get there? How'd that there get there? How'd that there get there? there. Hello, oh, YouTube. Yeah. Um, hopefully, everybody, we are live on Facebook and YouTube at the same time. And um, we, <laughs> we are testing a jerry-rigged setup, completely jerry-rigged setup for um, our live stream. Seven devices. I just walked. I just I did it there, and I went <laughs> mm, overkill, yes. perhaps. But um, we're not. trying this. We are. Um, we have a licensed audio is good, brilliant, sweet. Um, Daniel Mason or uh, Madison, sorry, on uh, YouTube. What is the audio and the video like on YouTube? Let us know, please, because YouTube has been suffering with per audio and per video. So mm. we're trying a complete jerry rig setup. We've got licensed software on our um, iPads, and uh, <laughs> so we've got we have two iPads controlling the streams, not crossing the streams. It's a reference. You might you're probably too young to get to what peeing beside each other. No. All right. Different crossing Ghostbusters. streams. Ghostbusters. Different crossing streams. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> And um, hello, lads. Jerry was the crack perfect for me. Brilliant, Jerry. I, I don't, I don't like this Facebook. Um, there needs to be a pop out chat like YouTube. YouTube, yeah. did Facebook not own YouTube? I know Google I owns know, YouTube. Google owns YouTube. So um, Zuckerberg owns uh, who knows what. Uh, so we've got two iPads running licensed software to stream out separately onto your main camera for Facebook and a top-down camera for Facebook and another camera for YouTube and a top-down camera for YouTube as well. They look all live. If they stay live, it's going to be a miracle because uh, that's uh. you're just clicking at buttons now. Just to... All good, land clear, prisoners, crip... <laughs> and good lighting. Apparently it's grand on YouTube. Then. So how are we all for Friday? Uh, we are, as, as you guys can see on the desk, we have a ton of stuff, uh, a drink for me, um, because I'm thirsty. And you didn't bother to bring me one? No, I didn't. Because uh, we're, we, were, we were running a little bit late. It was you it? were on. I was. My, I'm, Hence why my stream started before yours. Yes. I'm crippled. My back's crippled right now, so um, it takes me a lot longer to get around. Like I'm really is old. the one on the left not a surface book? Ha <laughs> <laughs> Don't no, swear at me. Tis an iPad. Tis an iPad with my fantastic combo touch thing. It's been brilliant. Your Logitech keyboard. I wasn't going to name. All the brands are available. <sighs> not a sponsor mm. yet. Um, uh, Nathan Australia is big fan of Logitech. He, he Nathan, loves Logitech. Nathan yeah. loves the whole logic of tech. So. Um, no, well, we're doing a stream. Sorry. So, um, so that's what they, that's the crack with the streams and stuff. We're getting all set up, and um, we're going to chat about some lights. Uh, so, yeah, what we thought about was doing a, a video on different colors of lights or our favorite sort of mm -hmm. colors of light combo. So, everybody goes sort of black, tactical, all that sort of crack. But we thought we'd go very, very colorful today and uh, share some of our favorites and I then put out to you guys to go what sort of color combinations do you want to see um do you want to try for i don't know is there a weird wonderful color that you want to do or is it something that um we've done in the past that you want to see again or something that's completely different one for me we haven't done at all now i want to do yellow yeah but I, everything yellow. how would you do it though is it going to be like a I don't know. Matte. I have yeah, no well, idea. Like, I, 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 we've, we've done no yellow lights at all. Yeah, so we did we're going to try this and see. Um, you, one of your favorite lights, favorite colors completely is orange. Right. So we're going to go orange first. So the, uh, we're going to go orange. So we're going to try that. So 
So orange likes. These are uh, some of our favorites. YouTube, you're going to have to let me know again what we're like for um, video on that, please. Let me know if you can see everything okay. Um, orange lights. I love orange lights. They're really, really cracked. Did I upset them? No. Um, somebody had decided that they thought it was a fantastic idea to um, park in our car park and... Um, when the bollards then were put back up, they're now gurning that they're parked in our space, in our stuff. So, what do you do? Now, um, so orange stuff. Orange is say, a staple. And, of course, we can't, we can't do a video with orange without putting in the Marauder 2. Just chuck it in there at the side and see how we get on. So, there's a whole lot of love in the comments for orange I would just cry. I'm staying out. <laughs> Get out, yet? The uh, the thought night either fell out with you or um like kicked you out. Or something. Like just walked off. Yes. yes. So, but again, she, to get, that's that's what happens when people start mucking around in our space. She's very apologetic. She ran in for a wee block ice cream, and she always thought it was for half an hour. I well, no, I think she stuck behind the balls for half an hour. It's <laughs> <laughs> all about. Then Green, who suggested that? I'm in for that. Hey, Lime hey, Green. Hey, Look, he's that. had the Seeker 2 Pro in green, which I didn't even lift. Oh, it's mint green. Mint green. Mint green, lime green, it's green. If I offered you mint sauce with your lamb, or lime sauce with your lamb, what would you have? None, because I don't like mint sauce. Mm -hmm. Or like lamb. lamb so. So, <laughs> I do like lamb. I just don't do the whole you don't mint even sauce. Mute your phone either. That is, that's <sighs> your phone, not my phone. Oh, that's so professional today. Yeah, did you upset it, him? Is it that is actually phone. Uh, Ivor Wallace, what's Ivor saying? Where's Ivor? Ivor, Ivor? Ivor was there, he's gone, he's there, he's not. It's not yellow, yellow. It is exactly. yellow. It is yellow. Uh, it's a lot better on YouTube, I think, anyway. Happy days, see, see? YouTube's brilliant, good. Thanks for the video. And cool. orange stuff, we love the whole orange stuff. Marauder 2, fantastic. Well, we're discussing orange, are we? We are, we're oh, going lovely. straight for the orange. Um, with the Baton 3, look at just all that. It's just sore on the eyes how orange that stuff is and uh, to be honest it is it is just like like crazy crazy orange um i i love it it's it's, uh, it's, uh, it's just you're not like benefits of buying brightly colored torches is unless you're like with mates and, and like you're all in that sort of thing you're gonna know what yours is mm -hmm. so somebody who um wanders around with another blue torch or a red one or an orange or whatever you know what's yours so it's very easy to go oi <laughs> give it back the whole Boing. thing me trying to like run around with pens yeah and like old jobs go is that my pen ah. is that my pen no like now with old light you've got different color pens some people even weird about serial numbers yeah let me check your serial number uh, yeah. but that's the way it no but I, I agree with I walk in here every morning and I have the orange collection sitting opposite the desk and, and I just sit there and Is that why you don't do any work? You just sit there and looking at lights when you should be working? <laughs> Best job in the world! <laughs> <laughs> it's research, product research, honest. Uh, lantern minis, yes, we are going to show you some lantern minis. Are you going to, what's that, are you going to put some orange, what did we get that on? Um, See, Facebook's annoying me here. Yeah, scroll up a bit. Are you going to put some orange, orange mini on a sec? No! Because They're orange done. parent mini that was um, pretty much like a limited run on them. Um, they weren't limited edition, but limited quantity. Uh, but again, these guys, you honestly don't really understand the sort of power that you guys have. If you guys push um, politely for uh, different colors, different schemes, different finishes, we do listen. And uh, yeah. we do, we're probably one of the very few companies that do do that. We, mm. we listen to you guys and we try to make things better. Um, I'm, I'm decided this weekend I'm going to go button free premium to, for a carry. Nice. I'm going to do the whole lot of my jeans and I'm going to carry the whole oh, yeah. thing. No, yeah. Nice. I think just nice. for the crack, was I, my jeans, big deep pockets, yeah. short yeah. arms, deep pockets, yeah. means I'm tight. I find myself going back to the, the i5T a lot recently. I5T? Yeah, oh, well, like, today's carry is really weird. I'll just show you like, today's carry. 
is that. Which the M one T Raider. Yes. M one T plus. Oh plus sorry yeah. M one T plus that is um, that was that's my carry the last few days. Such a crack and light. It is a basic on off, and uh, you got strobe on it as well. Two CR one two three batteries. Crack and crack and light, and uh, I just use that. It's got scuffed. Um, finish is coming off because it's been has been used and abused. Um, but I like that. It's just bang on. Very very simple. And I do like because it's me. Uh, I do like the whole keep it simple, stupid style of light. Yeah. Um, because it is just bang on. No mucking around. Don't worry about lockout. Don't worry about this that, and the other. It's good. Uh, will you be having more type of headlights? Uh, possibly. Yeah. So um, who knows? I'd like to see. I'd like to see a couple more headlights. But yeah, a good term of phrase is we can never cannot confirm nor deny. Stay tuned. Yes. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for more. So, um, and again, say so with the the Baton Three Premium stuff, like these these are these are cracking, cracking, cracking lights. Um, that's only a few, just to say the bright ones. Just with the cases, you know, you have that for the cases. And again, what I what I love about these, I've said this so many times, is because of the Baton Three Premium, you can. Um, use these with the um, S1R Mark II as well as the Mark III. So the Mark II will charge inside the case, it will not turn off in the case. So, for example, say that's a Mark II and I have it uh, turned on. Um, so there's a the light on. Turn on bright settings so you can see. So there's a the light on. If I pop it in the case, someone's going to freak out because I put a red torch in the blue case. Or the other way around. Sorry. Red torch and the red, red torch case. and the blue case. Uh, the race. <laughs> <laughs> so, in the Baton 3 um, series, if I close that and then open it up again, the light and uh, just YouTube, make sure you got that on YouTube because, again, different camera angles. So, Baton 3 Premium is on there, okay? Switch it on. If I close it, open it up again, the light comes off. The seat that if you're using an S1R Mark II, it does not turn the torch off. It will charge in the case, but it won't turn the torch off, so it can overheat. So make sure you turn the torch off. But it means if you can, if you can mix and match, if you've got a favorite color of blue, if you've got a favorite color of red, orange, whatever, um, if you really want to, you can have, say, for example, a copper torch in with the orange case, in with the red case whatever sort of takes your fancy so you can do lots of different stuff with that yeah which is cool a couple of people saying the i3t and i5t are needed in that blue i agree yes i agree yes. absolutely i want an i5t in orange yeah give me orange red and blue yeah release that or not red what did i say orange blue should say red yeah you could say red did we haven't done a like, red i5t yeah would you like red we i thought like we've done a red i3t but i thought we would have done a red i5t but uh who knows uh but again people love color matching mm -hmm. stuff it's just really really cool what have we got um what about a hairband for baton two three um use it for what for mine uh, this oh facebook you're doing me <laughs> I use mine, mine on competition. Competitive. Competitive. Okay. Uh, who knows? We could put that in. And we, you could. We tip for you. Is your head round? Where are you going with it? Yes. Hello, dead Hello. Fred. This is Henry. I thought he was dead Fred, but. Oh, Henry. Okay. Henry head. Henry head display. Okay. <laughs> I know this isn't the. Uh, the um, Proper man, are they? The S or uh, H1R, H1R style, style, style yeah. headband. But if it was the H1R style, style headband. Wow! You could use your baton three or your Well, S1R. you could do it there too, because you could just have um, on this. You could really just do that. It fits. Which is tighter than, than a duck's arse, really. So what, are you going to walk about? No, I was going to walk. <laughs> <laughs> walk, <laughs> walk about like that. Oh, sorry, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I'm the edit. Don't worry. I'm the edit here. <laughs> this is the whole thing. I'm returning it around. Yeah, you should. You should do that. Now, that pocket clip is not designed for it that way. Um, obviously, this is the correct torch, the parent uh, mini for that connection. But that doesn't work either. No, you could end up bending and breaking your. Um, this is why we try it for you. Yeah. So you don't have to. Yeah. Um, so that's that's pretty cool. Um, what these, that's not going to work. That's going to give you a massive headache. You're not going to work. <laughs> you don't do any work. You just said you just sit all day and look at orange torches on display. It's weird. Best job in the world. Um, watching on YouTube seems fine. Good. Uh, call me boring, but I like the uh, OLED blue. That is not boring at all. Now, that, that's pretty cool. We're just going to show you that. That is cool. Right, there we go. There's the uh, Baton 3 Premium in blue and with the uh, Warrior X Pro in blue. That is a pretty cool combination, I think. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, Northwest or North Wales 1000 on YouTube. I uh, need a brass version of the Baton 3 Premium and case. I 100% second that. Although I don't think you're going to get a brass case. That would be so much work to get. Oh, that brass case. A brass case. Wow. Imagine the weight on that Yeah, alone. imagine how cool it would be. The weight on that alone would be. But imagine how cool it would be. <laughs> a cool factor, a million percent cool factor. Weight wise, uh, you'd be bringing it. You'd need like a chest rig. To hold it, like you know, just to <laughs> it's uh, it would be it would be a little bit much, uh, a little bit much. Thank Why? You. It's it's just it's just the way it is. I can't keep up with Facebook comments. Uh, good. That that's a good way to be. Uh, so Team Orange, yes, Team Orange. We're showing orange stuff earlier on, um, and again, like we're, do you guys remember when we did the uh, Warrior X Pro, the whole RGB range of the Warrior X Pro? That was pretty awesome. Um, we did the, the whole uh, RGB oh, yeah, setup. Cool. Um, I I think I can't remember. I think did we offer that as a bundle, all three? I, can't I remember. think you may have been able to buy all three. Yeah, I, think I know you could have buy all, all three singly. No, but, but I think there was bundle. an option. I, I don't know. You guys bound to know better than us. <laughs> You'll walk in circles without their um, brasses in your pocket. Yeah, your leg will be weighted more to one side. Yeah. So um, RGB. That was our first sort of lineup of an RGB and just doing the range. And when we brought these out as a set, which was pretty cool, I must admit. Very, very cool uh, set of lights for that. So um, that's pretty awesome. Um, just while we're here, okay, uh, especially for uh, the guys on, thank you very much, especially for the guys on YouTube. Um, on the chips can you view. please uh, remember uh, if this is actually going to work? It's not actually going to work. Um, if you're on YouTube, please remember to subscribe to us. Click the bell notification. You'll be notified when we do live streams like this and any other videos that we upload. Um, so that would really help us um, for getting the channel numbers up. So if you're watching, are you subscribed? Are you got the bell notification on? Make sure you do that. Um, on the YouTube posts, we're on the so the community page is gone on YouTube, but we can just do a post on that. We hope to do um, giveaways on there as well. So uh, smashing that bell, sliding into the DMs. Facebook that applies to you. You get over and yes, please. if you don't have a YouTube account, create one just so you can follow. Like yes, and get luck. You could have even like more chances for mentoring competitions and all that crap. And again, for you, you will. I'm just telling you now because I know what's coming up. You will. What? So get over there and get subscribed to us on YouTube. Okay, uh, this is not in my head. So you have ah. to do so on that side. Ah, yeah. And uh, remember, guys, and if you're only watching on uh, Facebook, remember we are on um, or on YouTube, we're on Facebook and Instagram as well. Mm -hmm. So you can check out Olight UK on Facebook and Olight.uk on Instagram. Yoo -hoo. And that is the uh, the socials. Um, for us, which is pretty cool. Um, Just can I answer Nicola's, can Nicola away, X Ryan? 
Um, Hope that's not that's Nicholas question. X. That could be Nicholas X. Ryan. Nicholas X. <laughs> Ryan. Ryan. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, that's your question. calendar. <laughs> um, if you haven't used it yet, you have five days to use it. So you can use it until the end of the month, essentially. Um, if you haven't used your birthday thing, because it applies to your whole birthday. Month. Oh yeah. So, so you have five days to use it. So that basically means you. That's go, go and place so order. bad. What? Isn't that really like no the the whole like you our Facebook comment pages? Oh, it's just it's terrible. awful. Hey, you guys don't understand. I'm looking at hello. What did you say? It's about Nicole, forty-three sorry. inch screen. Yes. And <laughs> yeah, genuinely, like, the yeah, comment like, section like a business is, card. <laughs> I swear, the comment I5 section or is... What, like an A5 page. Yeah, like about the size of an A5, an A5 page. page. I, can d- I can display one and a half comments that are single-lined at a time. <laughs> it's awful. It, it is terrible, and you can't expand it up at all. You can't even, you're trying to click down, it's just terrible. Uh, otherwise, on YouTube, we get a whole different comment section. So we can see um, everybody's comment. There's no issues at all. Uh, I usually watch your YouTube channel on my 65-inch screen, but I'm not nice. on just now. Why can't you just skive off work yeah. and do it? Graphite. Uh, graphene. Oh, graphene, sorry. It's graphene. graphene. Um, I maybe. maybe. So it could work out. But I also remember this. Do you remember, guys, when we did this? When we went down the whole uh, camouflage route? To do a referral scheme, we do. We do do a referral scheme. We do 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 the referral. Send scheme. someone your referral link. They sign up. Is it still you get a favour? They get a favour. Uh, it should do, yeah. Something like that. You get something. So that is the um, remember the M2R camel. Um, so that there's a definitely a weird camel pattern. It was our own sort of camel patterns are licensed, which um, is you know you have to be careful when you're working with. The camel patterns are licensed. So um, this one was sort of our own sort of camel pattern that we came up with, which was okay for us to use. So um, we, you know, if we want to do more stuff in camel, we could do more stuff in camel. And um, this was de- this was definitely very very limited. Um, so we could maybe go out and do some more stuff um, along along them lines. Do you mean? Um, personally, at the minute, I would be recommending the Baton Three uh, and a bulb. Yeah, take a baton three and a bulb with you if you're going wild camping, because as Tom talked about a minute ago, they're that charging three point seven times of your baton three. Brilliant. Depends how long you're going for, obviously. But I found that week, I oh, went. No, well, I didn't recharge it the whole week. I was away. Yeah. And it, I mean, it was fine for me, and the bulb was the thing I used the most. And again, didn't have to charge it. it no. Fantastic. So and that is um, bring back camo, yeah, Jimbo. Um, that's definitely. And you know what? The whole wild camping. How the dog? Dino, Dino, you haven't been on here in ages. Dino, the mutts are fine. Marius has landed my guy. Very good, Ben. Fantastic. Tell me, said hello. Um, the Dino, the the mutts are fine. Really, really good. Um, uh, Chip is is come up four now. He's doing good, and D is, she would be coming seven soon, if she's not six. Starting to get a wee bit grey. I uh, wanted to take a letter from her, I don't think I'm going to bother. But then, um, yeah. So, why we're chatting about wild camping. It's a, it's what a, a lovely little link. Segue. Little link. So, um, sliding in, the uh, Warrior, or the Warrior Mini, Old Lantern Mini. Yes, so and it will be it will be awesome. The mini lanterns, they are class. If you have we haven't done like a proper review video of these, we're gonna give you an overview. Um, now so you've got rubber base here. So um, can I just quote you can oh, like Kelly from the States. They are super cute. Super cute. Thanks, Kelly. <laughs> no, they are they're really cool. Lantern mini be good for wildcat. Yeah, it will be fantastic. So you can see these are rubberized bases here so you've got like non slippy bits um you know if you're gonna depend i look if you're gonna go down wild camping or you're going caravan stuff tenting whatever you know they're gonna work out wild camping bushcraft wild camping these are gonna be good anyway you're not gonna be worried too much about the rubber base but if you're using on a, a lopsided tree stump that rubber bit is gonna be grand for you um this bit is metal. The main body is metal. And you can see here, if I try and cover it up, see that red light's on? 
That means this battery actually needs charge. But it's got this motion detection on it. You can see by the black one, if I just cover it, the black one is green at the minute. Just showing the battery is like pretty much 100%. But this motion detection comes on if the torch detects motion. Or if the, the really? Detects motion. Really? That's a weird feature. A motion detector that detects motion? motion? That's a winner. The only thing it doesn't do is detect sarcasm. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, we'll go, um, Sean, what is the lumen output? So, uh, do you want to start from high to low, or what do you want to do? Whatever turns you on. The motion. There, there's the postman. Oh, we better answer the post. Yeah. Bear with one. Bear postman one. Pat is oh. coming to the building during a live video. Um, what? So, um, anyway, I'll go through the rest of the features on this. So your body is metal. Um, you've got a, a, your obviously hardened plastic um, glass here. And then you've got your, your metal um, hook. Uh, there for attach onto branches or hook it up wherever you want as a lantern or carrying it. Um, your button here, just basic press on and off, single press. Once you're on, if you press and hold, it will cycle through the modes from low, medium, and high. Yep. And then when you double press, it goes to red. So you can have a red light. So all you guys while camping, and, um, and if, or if you're doing stealth camping, then a red light's going to work out really well for you around the campsite if you just want the bare, bare minimum of light um, for around the campsite. If you're not having a fire, things like that there, then you have that option. Um, also, like with this motion detection, people have said to us, even about the lantern, that um, with the motion detection that they're getting, it's saying, well, I charge this up, it takes, like, with the lantern, the big one, it takes, like, 10 hours to charge. And then it's saying, I come back to it in a week, and the battery's dead. What's the crack? This is rubbish. It's because you're, you're storing the lantern somewhere where it's detecting motion. So you're storing it maybe on your bedside table or in the hall um, or wherever, you know, mm. for, a, for an emergency. Like, you're storing in a high-traffic area. So when it detects motion, it is using that battery to um, sense motion, pick up on that. So what do you just lock it out? You can lock it out on the um, lanterns as well, the, the minis. But all you do is just press and hold. The light comes on, light goes off, and that's it locked out, completely locked out. So if I single press this now, nothing is happening. That's how you lock it out. You can charge your lantern while it's locked out as well. So that's grand. To get it back out um, of lockout mode, just press and hold, and your light comes on at the lowest setting. And that's your lockout mode. So useful. Yeah. All these lights on the table have a lockout mode bar, the likes of the non-rechargeable stuff. Mm -hmm. So the likes of the um, i3T, the, um, where we're going, like the M1T+. Plus, that sort of stuff doesn't have lockout mode, but you have um, them on the majority of our torches. What, what I found as well is uh, I feel like the the motion sensor has been upgraded as well in the mini. Yeah. So I feel like it, it, it uh, before I felt on the lantern, you know, you had to get maybe a wee bit close to it to set it off. Yes. Whereas with this one, I feel, you know, if you're back here, it's reacting Aye. to you. I feel, I feel it is a wee bit more. But again, as Tom's saying there about the lockout feature, because that is a wee bit more sensitive now, you might want to lock it out because it might be tripped a wee bit more. Anything but in a high traffic area. Like again, it's, I, can't, I hate battering about this sort of prepared mindset stuff, but I'm just going back to growing up when people had, you know, we had tele lamps and stuff in our house. But if you're going to have, yeah, can you guys, if you like torches, you're watching the live stream and all that crack, you're into this sort of stuff. Uh, you want either your kit charged up, you're not going to leave it not charged, not ready to use because there's nothing more embarrassing when your mate comes around your house and go here, cracking torch to show you, and you go to it and it's dead, and you're like, yep. um, a, a cool color, isn't it? Which it is, but you want to be able to show off your stuff, so you want it charged up. So use your lockout feature. Also, really helps if you've got young children and you've got maybe higher powered torches. Um, use a uh, lockout function. Now, there's no lockout function on these, but again, you can just 
twist the cap out, charge it up, twist the cap so you can't activate it, and um, and that's and that's and the best thing. And also, if you're you know out to the collectors and stuff out there, not, not even just the collectors, but if you have a large collection of torches and you know you aren't going to be using it for for three months, yeah. six months, take your battery out. Yeah, take the battery out of the torch. It doesn't need to be sitting in there. Um, you know, it's it's not going to do any good sitting in there either. Do you know what I mean? So, so it's better, better take it out. Um, but that's problem. the that's the Lantern Minis. Um, they are a crack and we light. Uh, comments on is people liking the um, for light green, red, white. Um, that might be pretty cool. Um, to have maybe a green light as well at yeah, the minute, cool. like an, R, an RGB style lantern um, would be good. Would be good. Um, so maybe maybe go mm-hmm. something like that there. But that so small, lightweight. Even I, I'm, I'm just going on in my head. I don't know if any guys are like truck drivers and stuff like that there. And maybe you want when you're pulling up um, at a truck rest stuff at night to have the likes of a lantern in your cab. Um, if you don't want to like maybe wear down the battery in your in your wagon or what. I don't know what way that's all set up. I'm not going to pretend to do, but I'm just thinking out loud what might work for you. Sorry, Ed Sheeran. What? Ed Sheeran. Song a very very famous song called "Thinking Out Loud." Oh, do they? Right. I, I don't know. Yeah, but, you know, the, the color, beer, the color. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I don't know. Sounds like an about. orange lens. No. Okay. Um. um no. Uh, then. Did you go over the specs? No, we did not because uh, we not? were distracted. But did he actually even send us an useful, or just send me some bills? Uh. Bills. Aye. Yeah. Bills. Bills. I don't All the bills of the day. So here we are. There's the lantern. Sean's going to go over some of the specs um, for the lantern. Can you show it off? So I can, I can try. Um, we'll start from from low to high on low white. To high. So low mode there is 15 lumens, and you're looking at 48 hours. Crazy. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And 15 lumens is a lot. It like, is. It you is. Know you know. It's not like my kids use. <laughs> they have a bulb. Yeah. Um, for bedtime because they like to read at night before they go mm-hmm. to sleep. I put the lantern on there to test them. It was too bright. Ah. At 15 lumens, I had to put the lantern away from their bed. Yes. Um, to use as a nightlight. So that 15 lumens, and to be honest, we do have a tendency to underrate the brightness of our lights. Yes. Um, historically, you know, we've seen teams that seem to true. round down. The, for example, like the uh, I1R Mark II. I remember chatting to the boss man uh the one and only ceo fox and we were chatting about the um i1r mark ii and we said what's the, what's the lumen i put we literally had just got it mm-hmm. and in america and it was like technically it's, it's five lumens in the documentation technically it's seven you know but we just round down yeah so we underrate our lights and they do, we, we do that with the throw as well yeah, we you do. know, you yeah. know, there's a good chance if you're looking at your your Marauder two that's a throw of eight hundred meters. There's a good chance it's probably eight ten, eight twenty. Yeah, but, exactly. You know, so there's somebody a uh, competitor brand double A was fourteen lumens back in the day. Oh, exactly. I bet it took twelve batteries. <laughs> um, so yeah, so that, that's your low mode. That's your low mode. Ridiculously long run time. Um, moving up then your medium, which is fifty lumens. Medium. Uh, 12 hours. So you're getting half Run a day. Runtime is pretty cool. Half a day. That's like, nice. At that brightness. Um, and then moving on to 150 lumens, which is bright, bright. Bright, bright. Uh, it's four hours. We should just campaign to change the uh, wording. Instead of low, you go meh, and then medium, and then bright, bright. Bright, bright. <laughs> Can you turn that on to bright, bright? <laughs> so four hours. What's the runtime on bright, bright? I mean, the thing as well is... is because of that sort of tornado-shaped diffuser that's in there. Which is pretty cool. You know, the, the light's coming out differently. It's not like, I mean, 150 lumens, yeah. 150 lumens is your I3. I know, sorry. I know. That's 180 sorry, I, for, uh, for that on high. But because it's coming out, you yeah. know, in that 360, yeah. it is it puts out a serious amount of light for and like, and that, lumens. Do you know what? And then I don't have the specs for the lamp, but like, see, just the... Just to do a size comparison for again, let's try and get this right for everybody. 
if I look at the size comparison between the Lantern and the Lantern Mini, it is, it is just nuts, the size difference. And um, look at the, that's low, and that's low on the G other it, lantern. It genuinely does fit in your pocket so easily. Yeah, but look, even, because at the top of the lid here on the lantern, we have like a reflector mm -hmm. built in. But look just the way the light's spilling. You don't have this gap. Mm -hmm. Your light mm -hmm. is completely filled up here, and it's pouring out of it. This one, your light's concentrated down the bottom, and then when it hits a reflector, you're pushed out. So that's that's quite a big um, difference on that. Red light on the um, Lantern Mini. Yeah, and, I, and again, again, I would guess this is probably underplayed. One lumen, apparently. Uh, 34 hours. Yeah. That's, I'd say, it's, I a bit, think I'd say it's a bit brighter than one lumen, to be perfectly well, honest. I definitely think it's brighter than one. Um, but look at it, that there. I know it's hard with daylight for red. Yeah. But that's 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 pretty cool. Sticking that in your tent or whatever, and say around your campsite, even if you don't use it as a marker, if you're out doing um, like I remember, see wild camping. I remember when I was at wild camping and uh, we would set up our camp, get something to eat. Um, even if we if we weren't even having a fire, we would get these boil in the bag stuff or whatever to get something to eat. And then we'd go out like doing like a, a dusk, sort of nature walk. And uh, look for signs of even just rabbit, uh, badgers, foxes, things like that there. And I remember like sitting in a field watching badgers coming out of their sets and playing and uh, just spooking around, which was fantastic. But then going back to camp, having your lantern hanging up on red. So if you do miss your bearings when it gets dark, dark, and uh, that's not a setting, dark, 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 um, you could have that hung up on a tree and then pick your red light if you know your rough sort of direction of travel and um, you know you're not giving away you know, where, you're, where you're camped up because again some people are just you're not allowed to camp there when you are actually and just people are just idiots yeah buck idiots as I'm calling them so um, yes son it's called O light well done you can read <laughs> just got these kids going what's that there um, see, ask him if he wants to uh, go to A and E next time he kicks up, because he'll end up hurting himself. So there we are. We just released the Sean um, on them. So what else you got going on? Um, that's really compensating your brand when you underweight your specs. Yeah, it's it's it is. We do. We've done it so many times, and say so speaking to the engineers. Um, it's and I, and I even test that I remember like when we released like the uh, the Warrior X Pro and we knew sort of what distance we were from uh, different objects we just uh, I lazed them with a rangefinder or whatever and you knew that and you're going I can see beyond that you know so that I know that light's hitting beyond that so it's good to um, sort of underrate stuff it is he <laughs> hurt himself he could end up in he see if he does that there and like breaks himself on that wall he will hurt himself uh, so apparently they were just going to go climbing on the front canopy as you nice do. as you do um and i assured him he was not that's a money maker we could we could, could just hire that out we should hire that out I know it's like, all we need is someone to dig a 250 rope. one lap of the canopy nice mm. that could work 250 a while cheap so maybe that could be an introduction offer and if you like and share you can get more yeah right have you done everything with this? Yes. You've said about the differences between, obviously, whenever you get this, whenever we do put it on sale, which we hope it will be yes. soon, don't try and take it off. Yeah. The I top does say. not come off. It does not one. come off, all right? You don't need to muck around with this. This one, the lantern, you could take that out to swap out between that and the wee, like, flaming um, option. Um, remember, the lantern mini is IPX4 as well, which is, like, spray from any direction yeah it's not a, yeah i think uh, yeah I well, think it's not it's waterproof proof type splash thing, isn't it? yeah spray rain stuff from any direction it's not um normally uh, it's not waterproof light so but there you go uh you can see one of them string around the neck but what i don't know where we're going with that because you can't see the rest of the comment um 
Let me get my truck knife back home as I can. Yes, that could work. So, what else we got going on? Um, so I need a hands-free light headlamps. Not big fan of them. Um, so I can. Uh, yes. Um. What was that? Nah, you don't want to know. Okay. It's up to there. Fair enough. Well, if it's that one, you just end up banning that person. Uh, that's it. Um, so, can it change the green light? No, it cannot be changed to a green light. It is w the lantern is white or red. Simple as that. Jeez. Uh, Olay Perrin is your favorite? Yeah. Uh, Olay Perrin, if you're unique. No, I send your guy. Do you use the Perrin? I, your man wasn't a fan, though, of headlights. Um, well, Perrin. The thing is, yeah, is pretty cool. our headlights are different because they're not just headlights no, the current range anyway you know that, uh, the parent too it's a brute of a light it's a decent way to light it's one of my favorites for a headlight you have the parent mini as well um for see that's the parent too we have a parent still floating around and that's the parent mini so we have one in between that um, however this one is excellent runtime um, mm -hmm. comes with a pocket clip as well. I have EDC them as just a normal torch and with the headband, but you have a proximity sensor. If I put this up to like bright, bright, you have a proximity sensor on it as well to stop it, um, you know, getting hot when it's the lens is blocked. It is great. I've seen guys, um, especially in the haulage industry, speaking to me about how they have stuck them because it's a right angle light. They stuck it out on the side of their trailer or upright on the back of the trailer and used it as a reversing light because the yep, reversing lights true. on their trailer mm -hmm. was rubbish, basically. So they used the Perrin um, as an re extra reversing light. And that is a really wide spread. Yeah. There's not like a million miles of throw on it, but it's such a wide spread of a light that you slap that in the middle of, like, of your trailer and you're reversing up. You know, you're going to see everything. Yes, time of year comes into it as well. Where we are now, it's you've got like 16 hours of daylight. You know, so, but there we go. That's the idea. Is that what that loop's for in your rucksack? Is it for what? sunglasses? What loop? And a rucksack sunglass loop holder on the shoulder. Oh, it's one of them in my rucksacks. The, you know, the, the wee things there at the shoulders. The wee, like, sunglasses. Yeah. I've always used it for like a parent mini or something, but yeah. Hmm. Uh, I have the parent mini used to work perfectly on my motorcycle hands free. Fantastic. Yeah. Sean um, used parent mini for um, helping somebody start their car. Didn't you? That's not. Oh, uh, it's not really. No. Yeah. But yeah, you have experience with that. Yeah. It is. No, it does. I mean, anywhere it will just on. Perfect. Really good. Really, really good. It's pretty cool. Just don't leave it behind. Um, no, don't, leave, don't, don't, please don't. Last, um, before, look here, too, we're on there, 45 minutes. Last thing before we um, go is I want to show you like sort of the weird color lights. And that's it. So our weird ones, say we did go down the camel route, but sort of newish ones that we've got going on here, mm. we have the likes of the, um, the mountain sky additions. We have the ocean camo. Um, stuff there, which is pretty cool. We have the Blurple Parent 2. Blurple Parent 2. That was pretty cool light as well. That was. It was nice. Um, I don't have any handy um, no. for that. But these sort of colours of lights. If you are interested in um, you know, different sort of designs like this, then you know, let us know what, what you think. Feel free, like to, if you're good on Photoshop or whatever, to knock up something as a design, you know, and, and put it through us for um, you know, for some ideas because we do listen to you guys. But the ocean camo, I really like that. I really like yeah, that. Yeah, it, it, it is real nice. For me, personally, to EDC that, I would probably change that bezel from the aggressive one to the smooth bezel. Mm -hmm. But that's just me. Um, but... <laughs> I like whenever, it. whenever I seen the the warrior the warrior mini, um, and whenever I seen the i three T obviously before that in that mountain sky, yeah, I remember looking at it going, I really like that. Why do I really like that? 
And it only dawned on me, like, you know, a few days later, whenever I think I was walking into the warehouse or something, I went, the MTR. You know, because it plays off the, yes. the colours of it. And I was yeah. like, yeah, you know, that's really it's nice. It's a good combo. Yeah. Like, that's, you could even, like, I see having them as their combination light. Yeah. I think that looks pretty cool. You know, having them. So if you ended up getting, like, a, a ocean camo, ocean camo, mountain sky, you know, that is such a groovy looking combination. Mm-hmm. And, you know, the last sale event, we had these on as a bundle option with the uh, Mountain Sky and uh, with the Mountain Sky Warrior Mini 2 and the Mountain Sky um, i3T. I say, I do like the uh, pocket clip having it with uh, bezel down. It's my favourite way to carry lights is bezel down. Um, Just, again, simply because I'm going to take the light out of my pocket and then straight away, bang, it is, um, I can use it with the... Uh, tail switch or side switch or whatever that's just me I'm weird so um, um, there we go Tony you said the magnet on your Secret 2 Pro is not as good as on your other lights right but two things it's heavier it's a heavy torch it is a heavier torch Um, so that may be it other thing is if you do genuinely feel there's a fault with it um, that's no job give a shout but again remember that they aren't like the magnet is it's for primarily charging. there uh, to charge your light it's secondary is for you know for hanging it off something you know but primarily it's there for the magnetic charging yeah. um of the, the lights light. of the seeker too i mean they're they're primarily hanging upside down no it's not an omog you know not for ha- hanging sideways like yeah. the parents and stuff like yeah, that because they're, they're primarily that, for straight up you know I, what you I mean? can't it's like I, you can sort of half hang that that oh, is so front heavy yeah, yeah, exactly. On the, on the lens, uh, you, can, you can't just no, but they're not for that. That's the thing. You know what I mean? It's, it's yeah, that was weird. You got a wee message popping up on that on this. Yeah, what does it say? Don't know why. It just popped up and went weird. Uh, no, it was inside the app. Weirdly, but we're still going. We're still live, so that's okay. We'll just ignore it and say nothing. Um, last one, which is not a colourful light, but I have to show it off, right? Because we haven't, I don't think we've really explored this colour. No. Oh. You, you were chatting oh. about it. Yeah, so we were earlier. talking about this in the office earlier. Yeah, we were yeah, chatting yeah. About, is the gunmetal grey. We've done gunmetal grey so in the uh, M2R. We've done gunmetal grey in um, the uh, Warrior X Turbo. We've done gunmetal grey. Um, what else? Mm-hmm. We've done gunmetal grey. We've done gunmetal grey. I have an R. I have an R. And um, we've done gunmetal grey in a couple of our pistol lights. Mm-hmm. So I think, um, I don't think we're done. Personally, I don't think we're done. I with hope we're grey. not done. No, the, I, the, I would like more. The worry, I, my worry X Pro is gunmetal grey. And that was yes. one of the first big torches I bought. That was before, well before I came to work here. Yeah, and we have. And done, was, yeah, worry X Pro. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yes. It's like, it's real nice. I like it. But I don't think we're done with that color. No, I hope not. I, I think it's pretty good. What do you guys think? You know, let us know what do you guys think about the um about the color options of the Warrior X Pro as well. As we'd like to know. Gum out great i5T, yeah. yeah. Forgot all about that. Yeah, big time. Um but I don't Ooh. Oh, oh, e. I need to look mine out. I uh, definitely have one. I need to look for that. Actually that's a good shout. That was a really good shout. I need to look for that. Ching Chang Water Water Bing Bang. Yeah, MTR, Gunmetal Grey, a lot of love. Gorgeous. For it. Lot of, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we did, yeah. That Carbon Fibre Secret 2 Pro. Aye. It's a Carbon Fibre effect, so it's... It was. It was not a Carbon Fibre. It's a wrap on it. It was, you know, so, it was um, great. It yeah. wasn't for everyone. Um, no. To do it, and to do an actual light in Carbon Fibre, I don't, I don't think... It was, I, don't, I don't know enough I, about, about the material yeah. to know whether it would be actually possible or not. But, I don't know. Um, but that's... That is some of our favourite, favourite lights. Um, so, we want to do a giveaway. <gasps> I just read a comment there and I just went, yes. What? Gunmetal Grey Marauder 2. So Oh, old. yeah. So definitely. Old. I do have an open in Gunmetal Grey. Um, yes. Yes, yes, you got one. Ba- right. Yeah, Gunmetal Grey. Maybe we have done a lot of Gunmetal Grey, we just can't think. I'm just getting old. No, well, technically, we haven't got the Gunmetal Grey open, so we can just no. count that. The Americans got the Gunmetal Grey um, O-Pen. I got one given to me um, for my birthday. 
um, by head office, which was very nice of them. So, um, but that's that's the, the gum metal grain. Um, what has been your favorite? Logitech is not the answer. What has been your favorite out of all we have shown today? What has been? Chuck a comment down about what your favorite um, light has been, a favorite color. Who said that? By the way, Dino, Andrew, Dino. I, Andrew Turner, I want you to post that photo in the group. I want to see that. Prentice Pin is more to present orange and yellow for his vote. That's I'd like to see that, please. Dino, you are going old school, son. Do you remember that? No, but that was back. I, I was watching the videos at that time, but it wasn't. That's, like, that's like back, you know, X, channel with the X7. You know, about. Um, that's 2016. 2017. Well, we were Sorry. chatting about videos or something, and we were talking about the, like, the X7, and it was like 9,000 lumens. But that was, was it? that was on live video that we were chatting about. Was it? No yes. Yeah. Sure. Yes. X7 or X7 Mark? X7. Prototype was only 7,500. There we go. That's how they do it. Uh, so on YouTube, Cam Brown, orange or red or orange, um, is definitely as his. Mini favorite. Lantern. A lot of love coming in there for the Mini Lantern. War Mini 2, Mountain Sky, absolutely love it. Yes, Rugged Track, Lantern Mini. Lantern in red. Pretty cool. I will say, guys, see the black lantern? I Just think it's sick. I think it's really cool. It's, it's, it's nice. It is real nice. Everything black, it except nice. for that blue. The blue band. It's nice. It. It's nice. It just sets off. Again, it, it is going to be... Um, sorry, I'm trying to squeeze around here. Someone said they love your mug. Um, they do. Not your, uh, not your bake. Not my face. Not your bake, mate. Just nobody, your... trust me, nobody loves this. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, that's, um, I think I got, where did I get this? Blue Baton 3 Premium. What do you Absolutely. call that shop down there? The one that you got Disco. cheap stuff from? Um, V2 Disco? No. The one beside Tesco. Oh, Bargains Home. Home Bargains, yes. Home Bargains. That's where I got that. Other discount retail shops yeah. are available do you know why because you can't afford a yeti mug getting like 60 quid for the same thing mm. it's the same thing but it says I, yeti i mug. think they're all lies i think they would do roughly the same thing they do yeah but no can't say that because then people just say other oh, torches <laughs> i mean yes yeti is the the light of uh you know the what the uh just the oh look a bird yeah let's just uh, skip that all together mini lantern red yes your m1t pro yes spike welfare yes and the m1t uh plus is a pretty cool light um remote for they lantern. were available for that's sale so if you didn't pick one up what what remote Who? for the lantern that's an interesting a remote. concept yeah that's actually quite an interesting concept who knows then the only thing I'm thinking about that is if you lose the remote. No, no, no. Like, it's just an additional thing to use with it. Yes. Maybe you could have it that, like... Or Bluetooth. It's, aye, but maybe it's like a wee disc, right? And yes. what you do is, all you do is you attach the disc to the magnet on the bottom. Yes. And then you have your remote to use separately, and then you can take the disc off if you don't. It could work. And, then it could, and then it could attach itself to the remote. Then start taking I'm, that as their I'm idea. taking that off later. <laughs> Um, what else we got going on? Um, YouTube, any more comments on YouTube on your favorite lights? Uh, green camo M2R or blue Baton 3? Yes, mm. definitely. Red Baton 3 Premium. Now you're sucking diesel. That would be pretty cool. Black Lantern Mini. Yes, Black, it is. You Black Lantern it. Mini. Get it. And again, these, are, these were on sale in the States this month, June, wasn't it? I think it was June. What's that? The Lantern Mini. Yeah, it was, yeah. It was so last class we there, yeah. hope, don't hold me to it, but we hope to have these for sale next month, um, all being well. We, again, subject to change and, you know, shipping and all that sort of crack, we hope to have the Lantern Mini, um, which would be pretty cool. Yeah. So, right, we need a question for, uh, for a giveaway. So let's see um, well, some... Which we're going to do first, Facebook or YouTube? Uh, we can do Facebook first. Yeah. If we want, do Facebook first. Let's see some readies in the comment section on Facebook. Ready, 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 ready. Do you have a question? Are you ready for love? If, he, if anyone comments, yes, I am, you don't win. You that's, do win. That, <laughs> that's not the question. <laughs> Lauren comments. Um, ah. <laughs> um, have so I, uh, 
Uh, Jason, Jason, do you have a question? Because I don't. Um, I think. I have a question. No, I think it's. Oh, do you? I think yes, I, think I have a question. So you're all ready? 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 Good. Now, remember, if you have one before, then please sit out, you know, just like pump the brakes and uh, let somebody else win um, because we'll need to um, just be fair for people. You can think up of a question for YouTube, okay? Because I've got a question for Facebook. What? Um. What are you doing? <laughs> you look like a duck. Duck, duck, goose. <laughs> right, <laughs> so we've got readies. The question is for Facebook only. How many times were we interrupted during this live stream? That is your question. How many times were we interrupted during this live stream? First um, response that we get on the comment section on our side will win, uh, will win an I3T in Mountain Sky. This will be the bit where the actual comments freeze or something. Probably. Um, but this will be the first one uh, that we see on our side, not, uh, not on your screen because yours is different from ours and Facebook and delays and blah, 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 uh, possibly. I have yeah. a winner. I would go back up and down again just to make sure, mm -hmm. um, just to be sure, be sure, because then the readies and all that crap coming through. Um, no. Until they so them. how many times were we exactly? Yeah, that's what? me. Then, um, yeah. nope, no. Hi. No. Ah, yeah. see, I you don't know. remember. I'm you don't even know the wrong. answer. I don't. Oh, yes. So we have a winner. Rob Chapman. Rob Chapman. The answer was three. Three times. Sean didn't even know how many times. I thought it was two as well. So <laughs> I saw it out for a second. And then I went, was it really? So you had the old ice cream lady locked in with the bollards. Uh, Postman Pat. And then you had the youth of today. <laughs> <laughs> and the problems with the youth of today. Mm -hmm. um, so we had the climbing um, incident, we had the ice cream incident, and we had Postman Pat. Mm. So it's three times that we've been interrupted today on the live stream. Um, so, Rob Chapman, can you please slide into RDMs? Don't scope your knees. <laughs> right? Slide in to the DMs or email contact at olightstore.uk with your full UK or Ireland address. Mm -hmm. um, yes, Donald. Yes, Donald. We are I sure. I say, look, Donald, you can go test it, it goes, out for yourself if you don't believe us. It goes on our screen. No, no matter who's watching, comments appear in different orders for everybody. If you're on an iPhone, an iPad, a computer, whatever, they do display genuinely in a different, different order. So we tested this. Go. So we have to go with whatever's here. That's it. Blame. Forgot woman parking. That Chris on YouTube, that was Ice Cream Lady. Ice Cream Lady. Ice Cream Lady. Um, ice Cream Lady, Youth of Today, and Postman Pat. Yeah. Um, that was the uh, interruptions. Join in next week where we'll be interviewing them all. <laughs> <laughs> and asking them the questions. <laughs> Why? Why? So... <laughs> Do you know where it is? So, uh, yes, forgot about ice cream lady. Now I want ice cream. Yes, Nick. Yeah. So, last Friday, you rudely interrupted the live broadcast. Any reason why? Um, because I'm an idiot. This is <laughs> important live for OLED UK. So, um, that was... Was Ice Cream Lady nice? Was she nice or was she... She was very apologetic. Um, well, not really. She, she didn't know that we had taken over the premises and I, uh, I, she'll never do it again, she I, said six times. So I didn't realise the two big signs that say private car... Private well, car. Uh, you say big signs, your head's bigger than them. All right. I'm just saying, technically it probably is. Quite insensitive. That's yeah. hardly insulting. Well, it's just because you're so short that you can't see how big the signs are. Oh, and congratulations. The sign didn't fall down. <laughs> All right, don't tempt fate. Fate likes... <laughs> so, congratulations, sign didn't fall down. All right, okay, tag me. All right, okay, tag in the big hip issue. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We could, we are the next Stephen Nolan. 
So, um, I if you ate me, maybe. Um, you are such. I'm gonna. That's not an insult. That's not an insult. That's not an insult to you. Ow. Right, YouTube. Are you ready? Whoever might still be watching on YouTube. Have you a question? I have a question. You were, you're doing the question. So, uh. And you threw me with your question. So. Right, YouTube. Need some readies in the comments of the sections. And um, then, once we get a couple of readies on YouTube, then we will, um. We will get the question up. So, if you're ready, um. If you're actually still here, uh. Sean Dean is ready. Sean Dean, I think, may have been watching on Facebook and then slid over his DMs to uh, YouTube. Oh. Maybe. Correct me if I'm wrong, young man. Uh -huh. Oh, quick. Oh, 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 the people, they're all flooding in. So we've got the ready, ready, readies. Um, well, Foxtrot Romeo 25 is in too. So, um, very good. Um, uh. I, I, was somebody I'm gurning? Was, was that their message? Or was somebody gurning? No, I don't I know. It's, in? it's oh, all sorts. Yeah, it's, all sorts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's all good. Right. <laughs> so. I would go for oh. something simple. Oh, my word. That, are you sure? Eight. Okay. The only way. See, I tell you. I tell you. See? I, I would do the same, Sean. Don't worry. I would do the same. Right, Doc. Right. O oh, Lantern Mini, what is the lumen output on medium and the runtime? Oh, that, that, that's a, that's, it's going to be hard. Thanks, you? Yes, because it's not even think. listed on our website yet. Aye, but we talked about it. Okay. The if you get that. If you're, if you're paying attention. If you get that, then um, you, you're, you're, you're amazing. Two hours later. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Uh, Oh, the info isn't even on their website. It isn't on our website. Yeah, you're it's not even supposed to listen. go away now and look up the website. You're supposed to listen to the video. That's the whole point. Right. Okay. Have I? Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. Who? The two, there's three. There's two. Um, They're all, honestly, all these people are very, very quiet. Let's just double check. Oh, look, all these ones were really, really quiet watching uh, YouTube. And now they're all being really active. So I think they've all just slid over. Mm -hmm. Who? Ah, if you say so, I can't remember what it is. I'm Congratulations. So the answer was 50 lumens for 12 hours. And we've Lee still got people on Facebook answering. You've had your turn. Yeah. Lee Davies, well done. Lee, Lee Davies from YouTube. Uh, do you slide into YouTube DM? No, you can't because there's no YouTube DMs anymore. Oh. Um, Ladies, can you come over to Facebook or Instagram, whatever one you have? Or just email contact at olightstore.uk with your full UK or Ireland address. If you're outside. Oh, Dad. All right. Can you please send your answers on a postcard? Um, if you cool. cannot slide into the DMs of emails, no lots of the crack, and you're outside of UK and Ireland, then we will just uh, pick. We'll go back to the comments and pick yeah. somebody else. So as long as you're in the UK or Ireland, then uh, we will uh, sort you out. So mm -hmm. that sounds quite threatening. We will sort you out. See if in the UK or Ireland, I'll sort you out. I'll tell you what I'm going to sort out. What? A good tight lunch today. Oh, aye. Now you're sucking diesel. Aye. Right. You have had an hour and five minutes of our time. Well, I think we'll give them a couple more minutes of questions and that's it. If they want, feel free to leave. I mean, we know we all just come here to win a free torch, like so. I thought they came here to look at me. <laughs> I won't tell them if you want. <laughs> right, any questions? Uh, next week I'm using two devices, no doubt. Yeah. See, sure. Work away. Oh, see? Right. It's our usual plan. Any, any questions? <laughs> You're a cheap all man. All damn analytics. Uh, any, <laughs> any, uh, any cheap, any questions? Please want cheap. to ask us. We'll DM cheap? through Facebook. Good man, Lee. Thank you. Uh, we'll yes, get that to me and not right. here. So, uh, what I didn't know, uh, he could be granddad too. He could be a boomer. A what? Or a boomer. Is that not like someone who's born the baby boom? I have no yeah. idea. I'm just trying to get down with the kids and do some climbing up the building. Uh, 
when's the July sale? In July. July 2021 July. at the minute. Uh, that's <laughs> Might be pushed to August, but hopefully the July sale will be in July. Yes. I'm joking. It should be in July. We, so don't, know. Be too we don't know when yet. We'll, we'll let you know. I asked you to come to listen to the banter. See? Yay. Um, Is it possible good. to get lights advertised in the USA for the UK? Which, no. But which what ones? do you mean by which, that? What lights are you missing out on? in the UK or in the USA that can't get in the UK apart from like some of the tiny ones the likes of the uh, Patriot editions Odin Turbo DT yeah there's some of them ones that we, we just don't do the, the Odin Turbo Desert Tan there was only 2021 of them made yeah. and they went to the States so um, but yeah that's Could the we made same as Marauder 2 Blue I would love some more Marauder 2 Blue it's, yeah it's lovely and bright yeah definitely Brilliant. Awesome life, thank you guys. You're, You're welcome. so welcome, Ian. What, what? Uh, well, the new tool, Paul. Oh, Jesus. Well, the new Oto BW. Oto BW, can I? Don't know. Honestly, sure. don't Not know. Sure. Um, we're going to try. You don't have it. Them. I know. I don't have I it. Um, so, don't know. So, 63, 64 is last boomers. Okay. You're past it then. Or, I mean. I'm not a boomer. Uh, I want the MTR Patrick. Patriot? I mean, they're going to be available in the Aye, UK. That's the thing. Yeah. yeah. Like the, all, all the Americans think they're Irish. As I don't think any Irish people think they're Americans. Uh, but that's just me. Uh, Subject to change. Yankee UK. Oh, you're from Shonen. the US. Brilliant. Ah, Very right. Good. Very good. Sorry. We will try and speak clearer. Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> but is that a good Kelly impression? I don't know. Kelly impression? I think you need to go a wee bit higher pitch to be Kelly. Just, just the best. Um, uh, uh, we get you done. Yeah, I get you done. I know what you mean now. Yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, we should have realised he spelled colour wrong. Ah, yeah. yes. Should have realised yeah, that. Yeah. But yeah. Um, so, but yes. Don, we don't know. Uh, the Peter edition stuff, no. Um, some people, and I know in some Facebook groups, do use like a forwarder. Uh, but again, you could be hit with extra charges mm. with um, importing and all that sort of thing. If you know any of your family are still in the States, then you could just get them to buy it or, you know, you buy it, ship it to them to and then get them if they're going to send you like a care package over from the States with all like Yankee chocolate and all that crack. Yankee candles. Yeah. <laughs> Not Yankee candles. We can get Yankee candles here. Yeah, I understand you better than my native tongue. Dear help your native tongue. Then um, I've got my brother is in Virginia, and he had he changed his accent completely to y'all. Yeah. I was like seriously, but you, you grew up in Fermanagh. No, but you know what? I, my my uncle has been living in America, both of them since they were eighteen. Right. In New Jersey. This is not going into a question. Also, is more going into this is your life. Yeah. But no, he what he Jenny said because I remember whenever we went over. Uh, years ago and you know we were sort of giving them stick for having this um, American accent mm -hmm. but it was only really whenever he was talking with other Americans whenever it was us it was still there the twang but it wasn't uh, as much and he said it's just easier he said you do understand. adopt the, the language for them to understand you easier yeah. and I was like well fair enough aye traitor um, what what's that? I mean, we need a call thanks guys uh, so have I missed What's going on? Thanks, guys. I understand the bit hung. What about a flat? Flat LED floodlight. I know what you mean, like a flat panel sort of LED floodlight. Maybe. Mm. Who knows? Mm. That could be cool. Uh, we have small uh, UV small. lights and small lights with a red LED available. Um, the only other sort of lights that are, ga uh, well, again, we can't really change the prices now to buy four times interrupted on a live stream um see the bit that says um by appointment only so um that is our live video so um right we're gonna go oh is this the racking Oh, that? Yeah. Right, cool. God, we're due racking coming in. Oh, it's not the racking. It's just something else. Uh, aye, aye. Ha. Sean has to go here.
Bye, my lovers. Right. So, uh, right. We'll, we'll just, we'll just like, I'll have to do this. I feel like fucking Starship Enterprise going on here. So, he's lost. Um, that's us, really. Uh, next week, I'm using 2 Divide. Yes, we're going through that. Uh, have a great weekend, guys. Brilliant, yes. Right, so, that's us done. Hopefully, you like the live stream. Um, nearly went on an hour and 15 minutes. If you like it longer, like it shorter, what do you think? Um, we should have a giant OLED outside the building. Yes, we should. Really should. But um, that's us. Uh, we're going to go now and get lunch. And then we're going to go from there. So, beam me up, Scott. Yeah, it is, it is like, a, I do feel like I'm going over. I'm going to try and do dual um, live stream closing here. So, we'll see what happens. Guys, thank you very, very much. Really appreciate you all sticking by um, for the video. Um, did you get the DM? Lee, no, because we're doing a live stream at the minute. So, we'll get it afterwards, all right? And don't worry, we'll get it afterwards. Or... Just email contact at right store uk. Right, uh, look after yourselves. Have a great weekend. I don't have a clue what the weather's going to be like. I have family stuff to do. I need to cut the grass. But if it's wet, I can't cut the grass. But there we go. Right, we're going to go. Uh, thank you very much. And we will see you all soon.